Well, once I saw the community here, that was something I was really craving after you know leaving art school where you're surrounded by your peers and other artists and people to communicate with and bounce ideas off of and get you know critique from. Um, after school that just disappears. <laughs> and so this is a great place where that exists. And that was kind of the deciding factor for me where I was like, I wanna stay on with this, um, participate in the monthly shows and really get to know everybody here, kind of build up that art community again that you lose when you graduate. Well, I really like it. And I wish that this had been around when I started my career. It's a wonderful place. So I just started coming and I was like, this is really cool. I like the vibe here. So. The space is spacious, as you can see, like, you know, you feel like it very inviting and gets you back out to like want to see art. So the first show I sold uh, one of the pieces and it was the highest selling painting that I've ever had. So that was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> first one out of the gate. I was like, yes. Absolutely supported. Um, what I love, I think, most about the collective is that everyone seems to be a different medium. Um, and from a different background, with different experience, you know, some classically um, taught artists who studied it, some not, but um, everyone has been so supportive and encouraging and I definitely just don't don't sense any like raw competition but just the energy that pushes everyone to keep creating and you know keep talking about what they're doing which is what I absolutely love. So you always get inspired, you can share your ideas, uh, you can learn from other people's ideas. We've got like a once a month meeting and like we just kind of like have old business and new business and they're like there's every event you could want to get involved with it's like a really great kind of like newsletter almost I'm like yeah collective definitely is how I would explain it. I was very honored to have my first piece in a gallery in in the show um, sold on opening night so that was killer. Every time I come in here I'm meeting new members people I haven't really seen yet face to face and they're always supportive and really friendly. You're seeing all these different types of art and then you just you know, you take what you can out of it. You'll, you'll, you'll see this person that does this style and if you like it, you can start talking to them and start to learn from them. How do you do that? What paints do I get? I think something that I didn't, I didn't realize how many opportunities just to, to show my work and get exposure that I wasn't even seeking out um, are just here with the space and the amount of people that walk through. Community of like-minded people. It also has a performance component or a music component and I need that because I have um, interests in theater and performing arts and painting. And it's kind of a hard conflict to resolve, the permanence versus the moment. So they do that well here, I think. Being my first show and like out of the gate, having success like that was like, great, this makes me feel like I can you know, really do this. Like, it's not just a waste of time, you know? I always had like a creative side somewhere in me that I think I need to wake up. So it's really nice to be a you know, part of creative community. I am definitely looking to just stretch my professional wings and, and try new things with, um, with other artists who are also trying new things and who are encouraging. There are members from all ages and that's good for me. And there's parking. <laughs> <laughs> it, it makes you think like, you know, we're living in this world where we have this digital, everything's on screen, on screen, especially, you know, everyone's on the phone. So like when you come and physically see art, it, it when I saw the artists in the jazz, it kind of combined that feeling of being in the physical space and, and hearing the music. So it, it creates this emotion and stuff that you can't explain and you can't see it on screen. Really great, I love it. Um, it gives me you know, more reasons to create and more eyes to like, you know, see the work that I'm making and get feedback on it. And that's been really good for me. And they have studios here where you can work and it's just a nice group of people. They, they know what they're doing. They're professional and they're nice at the same time. There's not like a competition here or, um, or just like any kind of weird feeling of one-upping anyone. Like everyone just wants everyone to grow. And that's what I love about Fulton Street Collective.